The bid to build a world digital museum has been welcomed by scientists, who say it will allow them to research precious specimens how are now lie in museum pants. They include set out aspiring plans to digitize millions of specimens. In digital form record the 40 millionth organic remains at the Smithsonian will get an alleged 50 year. But five year in the draft, the crew says it is earning black information in the lighting for key study. Kathy Hollis of the Smithsonian Museum of Nature Story, who is guideline the draft down there, explainable, we are hard to do our whole gallery accessible in digital form for researchers to use on the internet of everywhere in the planet or we're cute certainly how the is the greatest fossil gallery in the planet. We include above 40 millionth specimens in the gallery, it accounting records the whole story of lifetime, so if it has a fossil member, it's potential there during the gallery. Items on social screen in museums present just a diminutive fraction of the collection saved off in pants. Or down there are pants there in the museum how refuge tea been outdoor for many decades, told Kathy Hollis. How is problematical if scientists wish to use all of such specimens, the joint testimony of millions of year of evolutionary on our earth, to know how lifetime plant and changes. So we're earning all of the information out in the lighting for study she added. In several cases, it is far more than helpful. For the extensive most of the digitization draft, museums will seize top quality assurance images and all of the key data, year, kind, wherever the sample was found, to do accessible on the internet. How one is precious, student digital C organic remains, for sample, is already authorizing researchers to know how sea lifetime in change sea levels and sea temperature. But the largest comprehensive digital information can in fact be superior rather than an actual fossil. Professor Emily Rayfield at the College of Bristol uses CT scans of Dino skulls and some bones to construct machine model for study. Time it would be hard though to raise the actual, brittle, fossilized cranium of Diplodocus, for sample, Professor Rayfield is capable to twist, rotate, squeeze and distress her digital dino bones to show how the animals would include excited, which they ate and how they interacted in their environmental. The helping her and her associate to resolve one the large puzzles on the sauropods, the little-headed, enormous-bodied dinosaurs in the identical associated team as the renowned Diplodocus. Human beings include wondered how an environmental could perhaps include backed and stipulated meal for so lot much ton, factory-eating giants, she explainable. A of the ideas has been how the differences in the cervix long, the cranium form and the dental form switched them to nourish on various things A of my students has been capable to use the digital information to testing the concept. The substantially intended restoration every digital Dino's jaw musculature and test how it bit and chewed. The showed how the various types of sauropods were really feed in various ways and thus perhaps on various types of meal that switched the environmental to suffer so lot of these 10 advantage ton dinosaurs at one day. Professor Rayfield's fellow at Bristol College, Professor Philip Donoghue, uses digital scans of old, fossilized microflora to make big-scale versions how show far more than part on how the they lived. We requirement to provide although, he added, how a digital museum is correctly and sequentially written and curate so how the information is of the highest probable quality assurance.